Hey everybody, uh, got another one today. This is a cool looking coyote too. This is in the same set. I just caught one here four days ago and uh, that one was a real light colored one. This one's completely different, completely opposite. I don't know if you can see it there. Let me try to zoom in on his front paws, you know, real dark on the front of his legs. A lot, a lot of dark on this coyote. Really well furred. Beautiful coyote. I don't see any damage with him. I mean, he just looks, he's just a beautiful coyote. So this is the second one for this set here. So, and it's the Friday after Thanksgiving right now. So uh, I just come around the corner here on this. This was the very last set I was checking today. I um, checked all my other ones. I put in a few more sets today and then uh, I didn't think I was going to have to do any skinning today, but it looks like I am now. So, very last trap, which is good. So, uh, I'll get him taken care of, and uh, this is number five. We're putting him up slowly, but we're, we're trying to get to 20, so stay with me, children. It's going to get better here before it gets worse, so just keep watching. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. All right, everybody. I'm back at the farm here where I'm pulling these traps today and uh, the curse has continued. I caught another possum, but uh, he's, uh, he's acting like he's sleeping, but I mean, he's, he's fully alive. Even though I'm pulling these traps today, this is where I, where I turkey hunt and deer hunt. So I, I usually don't give these, I don't give these guys a free pass like Boxy. Sorry, Boxy, but he's not going to get a free pass he's not going to raid any more nests at least the good thing about i'm pulling today i mean i got i think almost all but four traps pulled no coyotes here i caught what the first coyote was on this farm but oh well i just don't have the time after work to go check all these sets but uh we'll get this guy taken care of and like i said he's not going to get a free pass he's not going to get a ride home but uh we'll get these traps pulled and we'll get to the other sets and hopefully we got us a coyote today stay with me children all right, folks, a little scary here. Just pulled up to the next set after the possum, and I couldn't see the set. I knew that there was a set right here, and I see the fur sticking out. There's a skunk piled up underneath of that grass. I don't want to get too close. Let me zoom in here. Yeah, he's up underneath of there. I don't know. I'm going to have to try to get him out of there somehow. But he's got my trap pulled up underneath of that grass. Man, I walked right up there. I was going to dig that trap up, and... Uh, I'm glad I got back. All right, we'll get to try to get this out of here. This is a bad situation for me, but uh, we'll try to get him out of there. Get moving. We got a few more traps to pull yet. Stay with me, children. seven by the end of November, seven in December, and then seven in January. I mean, I got a long season, but we're picking them up pretty quick this year. I mean, I, I wasn't up to six this fast last year. So this is a beautiful coyote, uh, really nice fur. Not a huge one, maybe it, it might be a female. Really, really good pad catch on that front foot there. Um, that's what I'm targeting, the right front foot. That's in one of them number two dogless, or not dogless, number two square jaws that I uh, laminated the jaws on. And I'll tell you what, they sure are holding really well. Um, yeah, that's a good catch. This was a good set right here at the end of this uh, this uh, fence row here between two two fields. So this first trap of this farm, I got some more traps to go, and I got two more farms to go. Hopefully, this is going to be a good day. And, uh, Man, we're trying. We're, we're trying to get them. You know, I'm trying to get 20 for you. And for Roland Smith, my brother, he's he can't trap this year, so that's why I'm saying uh, stay with me, children. That's his his line. So stay with me, children. This is this is going well. Thanks for watching. Okay, everybody, got another one here. This is number seven. Like I said yesterday, when I caught the one yesterday, that I uh, 
I want to hit seven before the end of November. So we did that. We're a third of the way to the 20 that I want. Um, can't believe I caught this guy. I mean, I'm, if you can see the sun is just beating down. I was driving along the edge of the field. Oh, he's a little vocal. Um, this culvert here was, the, the grass was all up to it, but you know, I could see that there was a trail coming down over here. I uh, hope you can see that. So all I did, I didn't put no bait or lure. I just, I just blind set two, uh, two traps right in front of it. Like I said, the edge of this grass came all the way out here. He's got it pretty tore up, but I just blind set two traps there. I guess he's only caught in the one. I thought he was caught in both of them, but uh, I'll get this remade. I mean, there's, it, it's just gonna made add for appeal here. I guess I am getting a little bit close. I am kind of in the circle there, but uh, no, it's just gonna add for appeal the the scent and everything. You know, there was no lure, no bait here. Just I just blind set them in front of this culvert to where if they come out along this edge you know they had to kind of bump out where the culvert was and that's where i put the traps and uh if they went in there to check out the culvert then they were going to get caught so i'm going to probably uh go ahead and put this video up now because uh this is the third coyote i, I got some video and editing and stuff to do to get this video out but this is great this is number seven and if you don't know i mean i like i said my goal is 20. I'm doing this for Roland Smith because he's busy in the in the recording studio doing his music and uh, he's my brother and this one's for you Roland as, as will the, the next uh, 13. We're gonna hit 20 this year. Thanks for watching. Good luck with everything. Stay with me children.